mixed up. Is it? I guess I'm going slower. There we go, Mother Goose. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, I'm gonna guess most of you guys are gonna already know this is not Stardew Valley. Some of you might have already heard that I was going to do Stardew Valley for the Monday video. And I tried, it didn't want to work. So it worked before, I don't know why. My computer is just getting worse and worse by the days. So it is old computer. So unfortunately we cannot do Stardew Valley. So I figured I'm gonna start off by doing uh, Mixed Up Mother Goose and we'll go from there. I don't know what we're gonna do next week, but I'm actually filming this the night before I'm gonna post it. So it's all gotta be done in one go. So I figured that this would be kind of a fun, fun one to do. I'm actually gonna turn down the music a bit. Uh, there we go. You can still hear it. There's no voice acting, so I'll do all the talking for it, but we'll see how it goes. Um, I have not played this game in a long time. Yeah, I'm using scum. Uh, I have not played this game in a long time, so we'll see how good I am at it still. It's not that hard. It's a very easy game. I got it think on the King's Quest Collection CD they had it. I don't think this video is going to be anywhere near as long as it's supposed to be, so that's why I'm kind of talking now. But anyways, we can get started and we can go from there. So I'm not going to restore a game. So I'll put in name. We should have actually done Timmy too. Why didn't we do Timmy too? But whatever. Too late now. None of these kids look like me. <laughs> so I'm just going to pick the ones closest to me, I guess? I don't know, maybe? <laughs> there we go. Good night, Nora. I have like so many memories of playing this game. I hope you can hear the music still. I just kind of want to make it a little quieter. I'm also doing multiple things at once right now, which hopefully you won't notice. Oh, she's dreaming. Wonder what she's dreaming about. It's been so long since I played this game, but I, I know I remember these parts, so I think I played it I went, when I was living in Florida still I played it. So about four years ago, five years ago. Oh my god. <laughs> When I was a kid, and even like just up until right now, I always thought that this was another kid in the window, but I think it's a candle. I always thought there's like another kid just sitting looking out the window like creepy, like that's his eye, and then like his hair was black or something, and then, yeah. Oh, Nora, my rhymes are mixed up. Please help me fix them. This is at least a good game for if you have like kids or something. You know, you can still watch it. Well, that duck is annoying. Oh wait, I can't. Uh oh, this is not gonna be good. No, really? Okay, that's right, I don't need a mouse, so. I'll just use it this way. It's gonna be weird. So we have to like go around and find different things and match them with what they're supposed to be. I hate that I have to hold. Is there a way? Let me just see something real quick. Um, put away my game. Weird. Okay. Speed. That's what I want. Fastest. Can we? Oh, that's better. <laughs> that's better. Okay. Oh, we have a candle. We got the candle. So yeah, this is sort of my my quarantine video collection and uh, we'll find other ones to play for other days. Uh, is that someone right? Yeah, I think so, right? No, that's not it. 
This guy is down. I have a weird, when I played King's Quest, I, I, I attribute it to King's Quest, I got a really good sense of direction. And so even though I haven't played this game in a long time, I still sort of know where the characters are for it. So at least we got that going for us. Jack be nimble. Jack be quick. Jack jump over the candlestick. Ouch. Those bombs on fire. Well, at least my game can, or at least my computer can play this. This might be a little too fast. Well, no, it's not too fast, I guess. It's just for moving around. Okay, let's wander around. Oh, there's a watering can. Who needs a watering can? He's looking for his puppy. I think if we go up to him, he'll say it. Oh, where has my little dog gone? I guess is what I think is what it said. So we're looking for a dog as well. Oh man. So yeah, unfortunately I couldn't play the game I was originally planning to play. So we're playing this now and uh, I hope that's okay with you guys. I'm not sure exactly what I, hey that's like really close to his home. That's kind of weird. I think it's just right over here, isn't it? No. Up. No. Down. No. Over. <laughs> okay. Starting to lose my sense here. I don't really have a good sense of direction. We'll find it. Oops, I don't think you can go up any higher, right? No. I'm looking for a pail. Well, you know what? Let's just take her. She's right beside it. For some reason. Help me find my tuffet. Oh, wow. I don't know if I can find that. There we go. <laughs> I, love it. I love this game. It's, it's cute. It's really, it's kind of a cute, it's a fun idea. Little Miss Muffet sat on a tuffet. Eating her curds and whey. There came a big spider and sat down beside her and frightened Miss Muffet away. That's a massive spider. I love these cute little games that they made for kids. Uh, let me see if I can find something else. He's looking for... They're looking for the castle. I always like to do them last. She's looking for her sheep. Not here, you're not yet. I'm kind of also making this last as long as I can. Because we got a way to go. There's where I need to go. I knew it was down, like, sort of below the city, but I don't know. There's her sheep. Let's do that. Run, little sheep. There we go. Right? Uh, okay, she lost her sheep. Oh, she lost multiple sheep. Oh, okay. Well, that sucks. <laughs> so I will go find those sheep later. No, I don't want to run into them. Oh, she's okay. She's back at her thing. There's a couple like little kids games I might play throughout the time Just because again, they're they're fun Ooh, Don't want to get them They're fun. They're cute There's something little that I can play for you guys Here, Oops down I was close. Mary, Mary, quite contrary. How does your garden grow? With silver bells and cockle shells and pretty maids in a, all in a row. Look at all the flowers growing. 
Yay! She's so happy. <laughs> I love I love pixel art and how like simple yet cute it is. Like, oh goose, go away. Yeah, I know. I hear ya. If my computer's having a hard time with this, that's scary. <laughs> I just kind of hear it being a little louder than normal. This is a little different to kind of get used to walking around again. Oh, there's her sheep. I don't know if we'll keep them or not. Move, sheep. There's a ladder for Humpty Dumpty. I loved it when I was younger. <clears throat> oh, there's a dog. Um... Well, too far away to leave the sheep. I used to love sort of the, the look of this place. Like there's sort of a darker area and a lighter area. I guess we don't have to worry. The sheep will follow us either way. There we go. Little Bo Peep has lost her sheep and can't tell where to find them. Leave them alone and they'll come home, bringing their tails behind them. I hope so. I hope they didn't leave their tails somewhere else. Aww, again, she's so happy. They're so cute. Okay, not you guys, not yet. Uh, oh, a pail. That's not too far. There we go. Jack and Jill went up the hill to fetch a pail of water. Jack fell down and broke his crown, and Jill came tumbling after. The sun's so happy about it. Uh, I have a little sheep. Let's take it. I think we still have to go this way, though. I remember playing this game as a kid a lot. It's one of the few games that I played. I played mostly Sierra games, so I played this one. I played Heroes Quest slash Quest for Glory. I played King's Quest. King's Quest 3 was my favorite, was one of my favorite. And here we go for this one. Mary had a little lamb, its fleece was white as snow. Wherever Mary went, the lamb was sure to go. It followed her to school one day, which was against the rule. It made the children laugh and play to see a lamb at school. Ha ha ha. Uh, what's here? Food. I think this goes to the shoe. See, I like how dark it is over here. I always liked scenery, uh, like the this this style of scenery kind of thing at night. I I think because of this, I liked it because of growing up with this game. We'll get your dog in a moment, buddy. Supper time. 
There was an old woman who lived in a shoe. She had so many children, she didn't know what to do. She gave them some broth without any bread, and whipped them all soundly and put them to bed. Can we go in? Is there anything? Yes, there is. There's a pie. I think that's a pie anyways. Looks like, it's, looks like it could be a pie. I remember as a kid not being able to figure out there was two things that were similar and I wasn't sure how to tell them apart. But I'm pretty sure this is the pie. Go in here. This is his pie, I think. Yeah. Little Jack Horner sat in the corner eating his Christmas pie. He put in his thumb and pulled out a plum and said, What a good boy am I! I don't know about that. We're just going to take this with us. Um, who needs a knife? Oh, it's up in the castle area. We'll do that later. Let me just take this and drop it off somewhere. Oh, I know where I can drop it off. It's nearby. Because the mouse is here. The mouse can come with us over here. Hickory Dickory Dock. The mouse ran up the clock. The clock struck one. And down he run. Hickory dickory dock. There we go. Perfect. Sorry if you hear a kid cry in the background, that's my neighbor's kid. She cries all the time. Let's not think about why. There's the puppy. There we go. Oh, where, oh, where has my little dog gone? Oh, where, oh, where can he be? Here, Spot. With his ears cut short and his tail cut long. Oh, where, oh, where can he be? Oh, they're so happy. Okay. Is there anything in here? There's nothing in here, I think, right? Yeah. <clears throat> There's nothing in that one. Oops, actually we can go up here, I think. I think this is what I need for the thing over here. It might be at least a decent amount of time of playing. So we're getting close to the end. I always like to do that before. Jack Sprat could eat no fat, his wife could eat no lean, and so between them both they licked the platter clean. Yum. This is, this one here I never, I never heard as a child, and yet it's weird because I've played this game all the time, so... Did I just not remember this? Or what? I saw someone play it, re like, not recently, I guess, but in the last 10 years or so. I saw another YouTuber that I watched play it, play this game, and I saw this one, and I'm like, I don't even remember this one, but 
don't know. Maybe I played it all this time and totally forgot about this part. Ride a cock horse to uh, Banbury Cross to see a fine lady upon a white horse. Ring rings on her fingers and bells on her toes. She shall have music wherever she goes. Yeah. I played this one, so I was, I don't know. I just feel like that wasn't there before. But whatever. It is now. Okay, so who else do we have to do? I can't remember if these guys need to come first, or... I feel like it's other things first. Oh. I'm far up in here. He wants it. Oh. Can I go in his place? Does he have anything? He has a fiddle. Oh, okay, I know where that goes. You there, fetch me my sixpence. Yay! Okay. Uh, I don't know if I want to lose a fiddle this far away, but whatever. I live in a pumpkin. Oh gee, I wonder where that is. Go up. So, how is everyone else surviving the quarantine? I don't want to have, like, I'm not going to talk a lot about it in these streams at all, but I just kind of want to, like, in case people are seeing this in the future, which I'm sure most people will see this in the future. Um, that's what's going on right now is the quarantine for the coronavirus. Here we go. Peter, Peter, pumpkin eater. Had a wife and couldn't keep her. He put her in a pumpkin shell. And there he kept her very well. Just, you know, for all you, you men out there, I, I don't know if that's really what, what women really want is to be in a pumpkin shell. But, uh, I don't know, according to the game. Or according to the rhyme, I guess. Not really the game. The games are all... The game is based off all the rhymes. Okay. There's the castle. We'll go to it in a bit. First we have to see Humpty Dumpty. Humpty Dumpty sat on the wall. Humpty Dumpty had a great fall. All the king's horses and all the king's men cannot put Humpty Dumpty back together again. And I don't know if there's anything in the castle. There is. There's the sixpence. Oh wait, I want to see what he wants first. Shall it bring me my pipe? Okay, I can do that. Let me go. Oh, my back hurts. I've been sitting at a computer for too long. That's how I'm doing with this quarantine stuff. Um, yeah, so I'm not sure what games we're going to play. I know this, uh... Wednesday, we're going to start a drawing video. Here, wait, let me get this part done. There was a crooked man. He went a crooked mile. He found a crooked six sixpence uh, beside a crooked, crooked style. He bought a crooked cat, which caught a crooked mouse. And they all live together in a little crooked house. Um, let me just bring this closer. 
Although I think this is not, that's not for the king. That's for, oh yeah, my favorite one. No, no. So yeah, we're gonna be doing on Wednesday, we're gonna do um, a let's, no, it's gonna be a drawing video. It's about 50 minutes or so of me drawing. It's all real time. It's not maybe gonna be the most exciting video I have, but uh, I don't know, it might be. You might enjoy it. This one's my favorite one. Cause again, it's nighttime. Hey diddle diddle, the cat and the fiddle, the cow jumped over the moon, the little dog laughed to see such sport, and the dish ran away with a spoon. Some of these like make you wonder what the people who wrote them were on, let's just say. <laughs> like, the song would just make no sense whatsoever. These silly little nursery rhymes that we have. Okay, so we're looking for the pipe. I think it's over here. Where's that? No. No. Where did I leave the pipe? Or did I even take the pipe with me? Fog the goose. Can we go in here? Can I talk to her? Hello, Nora. Can I go in her, like, private area? No. Darn. I'm a nosy little kid. You can't die in this game, so it's like perfect for like young children who are playing, who might be upset, I guess, if they die. Uh, I grew up in a world where <laughs> you died very easily in games, so you saved all the time. So, but nowadays that might not be appropriate. I don't know. I won't get into it. <laughs> okay, so we're going to bring the king his pipe. I hope we can do the knife too. Child, bring me my bowl. Okay, we know where that is. That's not too far away. Actually, we know where everything is now. It's going to be nice and short at this point. Yeah, we're barely even reaching a half hour now. Hope you guys are enjoying this. I It's kind of last minute decision. Like I said, I have no idea what I'm going to play next week. Um, I did want to, as I, I was trying to say, I keep getting interrupted with the game. Um... This Friday, I will be playing uh, Day of the Tentacle, which is the sequel to Maniac Mansion, and it is it is uh, it's 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 an all ages game. Like it's sort of like a Saturday morning or Sunday morning cartoon or something like that. And there is no talking during like no no talking for me during Day of the Tentacle, just so you guys know. Anyways, let's do this one. Little Tommy Tucker sings for his supper. What shall he eat? White bread and butter? How shall he cut it without ever a knife? How will he be married without ever a wife? See, that makes no sense. <laughs> I mean, I guess it makes sense, but it's just so random. Whatever will he eat? Where did the wife part come in? But, uh, yeah, nursery rhymes are weird. There is another one. I actually have all three versions of this game that came on the CD. And I have uh, mixed up fairy tales, which I might play. 
I might do that one next week just because it's also sort of along the same line as this, but after that I want to get into something else, something that's a little bit longer. But yeah. Oh yeah, here wants the the bowl. I think this is the last ones that we have to do. Yeah, it's just the king now. His point is like worth three things. That's why I always leave him to the last. He's very needy. <coughs> Sorry, it's just dry throat. Let me take a sip of my drink. That's what happens when I gotta talk all the time. <laughs> oh yeah, see here up at the top here it has like the pipe, the bowl, and then the fiddler's three. What a weird coat of arms. Oh, my hair just blends right in. It's kind of creepy. I'm just a floating bow. Child, bring me my Fiddler's Three. Okay, well, we know where those guys are, and that's the last one we gotta do, and then the game is done. And we haven't even made it. Like, all the other videos, just so you guys know, except for maybe the Monday ones for a little bit, are gonna be, uh, like, around 50 minutes or more. Um, 45 to 50 minutes is where I tried to keep it, so, yeah. I hope that you guys enjoy this a little bit. It's just kind of a weird little thing I'm doing, so I hope that you enjoy it. Can you help us find the castle? Why, yes. Yes, I can. I wonder what would happen, because there was something in the castle already. I wonder what would happen if you left them there, because the king won't want them until it's time. Like, till he got all the other things. You trapped me, guys. There we go. So, I wonder what would happen, and then, like, what would you do when you had to get them? Just, like, walk into them and pick them up, and then it would be, like, all done? Okay, so we're about to finish the game, so I just want to quickly say, uh, again, hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, I'm not sure what I'm going to do next week for this, for the Monday one. We'll figure something out between now and then. And, uh, um, Wednesday I have an art video that we're going to be starting. The drawing, it's going to be all real time, so it's not sped up or anything, but we're going to be drawing a picture. I'm not going to say what picture it is. I've already recorded it, so I know that worked okay. And we're going to, I'm going to do the sketching of it and the inking of most of it, not all of it. I don't think we get the whole thing inked in that video, but it's about 50 minutes long or so. And on Friday, we're going to have the starting of Day of the Tentacle, which is a really fun game really funny story. I hope you guys get a chance to come out to come watch that one. All of these are going to be premiered on my channel at certain times of the day and it will sort of be the same time each week. Let's finish this game up now and I'll see you guys on Wednesday. Um, I might be able to say something at the end, we'll see. Old King Cole was a merry old soul, and a merry old soul was he. He called for his pipe, and he called for his bowl, and he called for his fiddler's three. It. Oh, I gotta walk. So now I leave automatically. I don't have control over it. This is the ending. We got 18 out of 18 points. Yay! She's very happy. Thank you very much. You have done a great job, Nora. Does she have like a walking stick or was there just sort of like a weird glitch of pixels there? And then we come here and everybody's here. Everybody's happy. We all thank you, Nora. Hip hip. Hooray. Hip hip. Hooray. 
hip hip. Hooray. <laughs> it's time to go. It is time to go home now. We ride the goose off. Goodbye, Nora. I didn't notice there's a, the mouse on the house. I, I guess I knew that before. It's not like I've never seen that before. And I wake up sitting up. It's creepy. It's time to get up, Nora. I'm not sure if it's gonna like end on its own or... Mother Goose and her design team hope you enjoyed Mixed Up Mother Goose. Congratulations on a job well done. I think that's it. Yeah. So this is the end. I guess I could talk now if I wanted to. Um, yeah, this is definitely the shortest video of the collection that we have this week planned. So I hope you guys come back for the other ones. And uh, again, so sorry for the mix up if you were coming hoping to watch Stardew Valley. I am going to change it on DeviantArt if I haven't already and put it so it's not saying Stardew Valley. And uh, yeah, if in the future I can get Stardew Valley to work, I will definitely do a game series of it. But right now, as it stands, it doesn't look like it's going to. And I don't think I really want to even try it right now for a bit. So I hope you guys enjoy this. Sorry it's so short. But uh, I will see you guys on Wednesday and Friday. Other than that, I'm going to head out. You guys have a good one, and I'll see you on Wednesday. Bye-bye.